Good morning, good morning, YouTube family. Good morning. It's another day that God has made. And yes, I am thankful and grateful for God's grace and mercy. And this morning, you guys, I just want to share with you what's holding you back. What's holding you back from getting your life where it needs to be? What's holding you back from accepting Jesus as your Lord and Savior? Is it sin? Is it the people that you hang around? What it is that is holding you back from getting you closer to God? Here in the Bible, it reads in Romans chapter 10, verse 9, it says, If you declare with your mouth, Jesus is Lord, and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. It's time that you turn away from your sinful ways. It's time that you accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior. It's time that you cast all your burdens unto the Lord. Because one thing he said in his word, he said that he will never leave you, nor will he forsake you. And it's time that you give it to God. It's time for all those things that's keeping you back, that's holding you back. It's time that you give it to God so that you can be free, so that you can be delivered, so that you can be changed, so that you can become one with Christ. This morning, ask yourself, what's holding me back? You know, as we look at the times, it's time to move closer to God because a lot of things are happening in this season. And no matter what happens, whether it's good or bad, everything that goes on in our life, it draws us closer to God. And which it should. And we should look at it that way. Everything that we go through should draw us closer to God. Circumstances, anything that we go through, it should draw us closer to God. Because it's time. It's time to move closer to Him. Because one day, we're going to close our eyes in death. And we want to make sure that we have it right with our Father. We want to make sure that we are saved. We want to make sure that we are doing everything according to the Word of God. And we want to be living by the Word of God, not just reading it and not just applying it, but we want to make sure that we are doing right by the Word of God. Apply the Word of God to your life so that your life can change. Allow God to move in your life. Allow God to change your life. No matter what you're going through, no matter how far um, or how long it's been, it's time to give it to God. Turn your life around and give it to God because guess what? There's a heaven to gain and a hell to stay away from. We're only here for so long, you guys. We're only here for so long. It's time that we get it right with God. So this morning, ask yourself, what's holding me back? And then give it to God. Give it to him and he will see you through. Right before we end this video, let's pray and give it to God. Heavenly Father, we come saying thank you. Thank you for this day. Thank you for this opportunity, Father God, giving us a second chance, Lord God, to do it all over again, but to get it right with you. Father God, I ask right now that you touch my family, that you touch my children. Father God, that you touch each and every individual that is watching this video right now. Father God, we give you the praise and the glory, and we just come saying thank you. Thank you for your son, Jesus Christ, who died on the cross for our sins, but not only did he die, he rose. He rose with all power in his hands. Father God, we asking you right now, Lord God, to deliver him. We ask him right now that you change. Father God, we ask him right now, Lord God, that you look down on your people, Lord God, 
and that we come unto you. Father God, we thank you for who you are. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen and thank God. This morning, this morning, what's holding you back? Give it to God this morning and I guarantee you that he will change you. As, it, as I always say, if God loves me, he loves you. He loves us all. Until next time, you guys, be blessed. And guess what? Remember that Jesus Christ loves you and he wants the best for you. Be blessed. Give it to God. Share this video with your social media platforms because everybody needs to hear a word from the Lord. Until next time, be blessed.